Today we're gonna to make our cheese bomb recipe. Everyone that's ever had this loves it. It's a favorite of our customers. So what we do is we just take one brick or eight ounce block of cream cheese. It can be whatever brand you like. And then one package of our dipping spice. Well, this comes, remember, in two labels. It's the same thing, it only takes one pouch. So what I'm gonna do, you can do this in a Ziploc bag and use your hands and just kind of blend it all together or you can use your mixer. It really doesn't matter which, which one. You want your cream cheese to be at room temperature. I'm gonna drop it in. One thing that I like to do when I make this is I like to kind of spread this out. And the reason is I can get my dipping spice in there and put it in there kind of evenly. It makes it mix up a little bit easier. So I'm just gonna kind of stick this in there like that. I'll pull this out. Get these out and I'm gonna let it mix one more time and you're done with that part. Super easy recipe. This is great to take places, especially during the holidays when you're supposed to take a dish. This is so, so easy, it takes very little time, and everybody loves it. Okay, I think we've got it mixed up good. I've got a piece of press and seal. You can also use wax paper, it doesn't really matter. All you wanna do is be able to form this into a ball. So I'm gonna take my cream cheese and my dipping spice mixture, put it on here. I'm going to put it together, form it into a ball. If you want to, you can even make this and freeze it and then take it out last minute and take it to a party. Um, they freeze really well. I'm going to put it onto my serving tray like so. If I need to work on that shape some, I can use this, pat it down, get it looking like I want it to look. You can serve this as is if you want to, but one thing I really like to do is drizzle some balsamic vinegar on top of it. So I'm gonna get, you can use red or fig, either one. I'm gonna use the fig today, I think. I think it'll go nicely with everything we've got going on. So I've got the fig balsamic vinegar. I'm just gonna drizzle a little bit of that over the cheese ball. You can use whatever crackers you want with this. I really like to use a water cracker and the reason is because I don't want them to taste the cracker. I want people to taste the cheese ball. So I'm not in any kind of competition between the cracker and the cheese ball. So we can set this out. Again, super, super easy during the holidays to take places. Everybody's busy, everybody's got parties, everybody's working. I like the water crackers, they're perfect for serving. Um, they do not compete at all with the cheese ball, which is what I like. I want people to taste the cheese ball and love the cheese ball. So I really do like to use a water cracker, but you can use whatever kind of cracker you want with this. So this is ready. You're ready to go to your party. Super easy, super fast, and super, super delicious.